Izzy Ruland. Sergeant, if uh, you could begin your recordings. Recording to the PC started. Cloud started. Excellent, thank you very much. Good morning and welcome to today's remote New York City Council vote of the Committee on Oversight and Investigations. At this time, would all panelists please turn on their video. To minimize disruption, please silence your electronic devices. If you wish to submit testimony, well, actually that's for another issue. Thank you for your cooperation, we're ready to begin. Good morning and welcome to today's hearing of the Council's Oversight and Investigations Committee. I am Richie Torres, the chair of the committee. Today, the committee convenes remotely to vote on proposed intro number 1770A legislation that I'm proud to have sponsored, which enhances whistleblower protections in several ways. Proposed intro 1770A would expand whistleblower protections by including whistleblowers who report misconduct directly to the Special Commissioner of Investigation for the New York City School District against adverse personnel actions. The Special Commissioner of Investigation would be required to investigate allegations of workplace retaliation against any whistleblower. And the Corporation Council would be required to investigate any workplace retaliation committed by the Special Commissioner of Investigation and high-ranking officials within DOI. This bill would ensure that a whistleblower is provided periodic status updates regarding any investigation. The investigation would conclude with recommendations for corrective action to the relevant agency or entity. If the agency or entity fails to take corrective action recommended by or acceptable within a certain time period, the agency or entity would have to provide a written explanation regarding this failure to the relevant whistleblower and the investigating officer. Furthermore, this bill would provide for legal recourse for any relevant whistleblower who suffers retaliation if corrective actions aren't taken by the employer. Finally, this bill would require more comprehensive annual reporting by DOI to ensure a greater amount of transparency when it comes to investigations relating to whistleblower retaliation. Before I ask the clerk to call the roll, let me first recognize my colleagues who are here with us today. Uh, Council members Ayala, Salamanca, Yeager, Rivera, Traeger, Kalos, I will now ask the committee clerk to conduct a roll call vote on this bill, and I recommend that my colleagues vote yes on this important piece of legislation. Good morning, and thank you, Mr. Chair. This is the roll call vote of the Committee on Oversight and Investigations, uh, holding a vote on proposed intro 1770A. We will begin with Chair Torres. I vote aye. And now Council Members Kalos. Aye. Traeger. Aye. Salamanca. I vote aye. Thank you. Council Member Ayala. I vote aye. Council Member Powers. Council Member Rivera. I vote aye. Council Member Yeager. May I be excused to briefly explain my vote? May I be excused to explain my vote, Mr. Chair? Yes. Thank you. Um, uh, first, I, I, I vote aye. Um, uh, and my explanation is um, my thanks to you for your leadership of this committee uh, during your three years doing so. Uh, with 15 days to go, I don't believe we're meeting again as a committee, um, okay. but you have uh, demonstrated incredible leadership, uh, incredible honor and intellect on this committee. And I am proud of everything you've accomplished uh, and uh, those political things that you've accomplished that don't have to be mentioned here in the council, but the work here in the council that you've done have earned you your next step. And I'm grateful for your friendship and your partnership and I wish you good luck in everything you do. Thank you. Thank you for those gracious words. It means the world to me. Mr. Chair, by a vote of eight in the affirmative, zero in the negative and zero abstentions, uh, proposed intro 1770A is adopted. One second, Chair. We'll just keep it open for one more council member. Absolutely.
I believe Council Member Powers is now in attendance. Thank you. Council Member Powers, how do you vote on proposed intro 1770A? One second, we're waiting for his audio to pop up. Thank you. Okay, Jonathan, you can ask him again. Thank you. Good morning, Council Member Powers. Hello. Oh, perfect. Good morning. How do you vote, sir, on uh, proposed intro 1770A? This is the bill by Council Member Torres. Yes, well, well, in that, well, in that case, I have to give it some. No, I, I vote I, I'm in support. Thank you, sir. Mr. Thank Chair. You. The revised vote is nine in the affirmative, zero in the negative, and zero abstentions. Thank you, and we will now adjourn this hearing and reconvene here shortly for the joint oversight hearing with the Public Safety Committee.